Coming up with good class names in CSS is hard, which is why some people just give up and write inline CSS instead. For example, we might have a page with an article on it. Now that article has a heading in there, and I guess that one could be pretty easy. We could call it article title. But then maybe the first paragraph after our title acts as an introduction, and our designer wants it to have a bigger font size than the rest of the paragraphs. What do we call it? Or instead of even worrying about it, we could use the adjacent sibling combinator, which is just a plus symbol. Now, any paragraph that is adjacent to, meaning comes right after, an article title will always have a larger font size. And we can do a lot more with combinators, like changing the behavior of elements depending on what comes before them, or we can combine it with has to select things between two different classes. And of course, I'm hearing people scream at me that this stuff isn't readable, and yeah, sure, it's hard to figure out on first glance, but we do have the ability to document things with this magical thing called comments.